So we have two types of column pointer. One is called add the rate n and plus n. Add the rate n is the absolute column pointer. Add the rate n is the absolute column pointer. And add the rate uh, means plus n is the relative column pointer. Okay. See what happened if I just write down my name. Let me uh, write uh, down something like this. Okay, this is a uh, means this kind of a scale I have. I just write down my name, my age, and my country. Okay. Now, okay. if I want to uh, read out with the help of at the rate n, so I need to specify the specific column position. For example, if I just want to start to read the name, uh, the first name as Sunil, so this will be as uh, means with the first column position. So at the rate one, okay. So okay. I need to specify input at the rate one. So what is the uh, means? I need to declare the variable name that is called name, and we need to specify the in format. So in format here we have dollar five dot. If you remember, I discussed with you dollar w dot and dollar car w dot. Yes. Dollar w dot will just remove the uh, leading space and convert into trailing. But dollar car w dot will preserve the leading spaces. Right? You need to remember right. these concepts. Then uh, see, now we are into uh, first position. So from first position to fifth position it will write out. And then uh, after fifth position from seventh onwards. Uh, fifth, sixth, seventh. So the age value is there. So I need to specify at the rate seven. So at the rate seven age then three dot for the number and again now I am into the wait um, yep why is it three because see for number we need to specify with the uh, uh, means the minimum width for a number is three because the minimum the minimum width is three yes means for the in format we need to specify the three dot okay for example, if you have a 1 or 1.0, one so uh, both will uh, look like a similar. Okay, so the SAS consider in that way, fashion. Oh, okay, so in case they do like, you know, 27 points or 27, like, you know, three months or something? Yeah, uh, not really. Sometimes what happens, we may or may not have the decimal places, right? So that's why it just having one uh, extra bit. See, okay. you need to remember only the boxes, okay, what I discussed with you during formats. Right. And then I am into the ninth position, so at the rate 9, I need to specify country. And the country is a character variable, again, dollar five dot. So this is just an example for us, okay. So last time I saved the data, uh, let me check, we have this prod one data. So here we have the raw data file. Yes. Uh, just give me a second. Here we have a raw data file called dfwlx. Okay. If you remember, last time I just converted this file with the help of a DDS. We have a DDS that is called data description specification. If you remember, this was, this was the data description specification. So the first one to three column, it's a flight number. 4 to 11 column is a date, 12 to 14 is a destination, then first class passenger is 15 to 17, and economic passenger is 18 to 20. 